Mizuno Wave Momentum 2 is the top model of Mizuno's volleyball shoes uh, coming in a new fresh look and with new ambitions. I've been using Mizuno volleyball shoes for a long time. I practice uh, dozens of trainings in the older Wave Momentum model and in recent months uh, I've been using the Wave Lightning Z6. Now I have done several trainings in the new Wave Momentum 2 model that I received from Lever Sport Concept. I was satisfied with the older model. Did the new model meet my expectations? I will answer that in this review and the following minutes. The biggest news is that the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2 brings a change in cushioning from U4 IC midsole to the Mizuno Energy midsole. Mizuno Energy is actually Mizuno's new foam with a high energy return that is noticeable immediately after putting the shoe on. With this new feature that running shoes from Mizuno for example already have, the shoe should perform better on both the jump and impact. And I can confirm that compared to the older model it can be felt that the shoe better absorbs impacts and adds energy on the rebound. Whether in running moving on the court or jumping on the block. A shoe with good cushioning is essential for volleyball players. Uh, since every volleyball player is uh, facing hundreds and thousands of jumps during volleyball season and you need to protect your knees and ankles. The Wave Momentum 2 isn't the softest shoe, but it delivers a reasonable compromise and cushioning balance between uh, softness and hardness. I don't really like hard shoes because you will feel every impact in them and on the other hand a too soft shoe won't hold your foot uh, again during quick lateral movements. That's why I think you need to look for and use a volleyball shoe that is somewhere between these uh, extremes. But cushioning alone is not enough, you need a shoe that also has good grip, otherwise you'll be slipping on the court and you don't want that. And that's uh, what I dare say the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2 definitely delivers. Mizuno uses high quality rubber that grips the shoe well on the court. Thanks to the shape of its sole, the shoe uh, holds well on the clean floor, you don't have to worry about slipping when moving quickly. When I try the shoe on a dirty dusty floor, even here the shoe holds uh, decently. Also thanks to the varied tread pattern based on circles and wide curves, the sole of the Wave Momentum 2 is easy to wipe uh, clean when needed. Looking at the design, the Wave Momentum 2 is similar to the older model in many ways. It's not a revolutionary change. The outside of the shoe is still a combination of a breathable and less breathable material. Compared to my previous blue color, different and fresh color combinations are available in the new model. The shoe still retains its stiffness. Also, it's not as stiff as the previous model. However, it still makes you feel confident in moving side to side when moving on the field and you will have good lateral stability. The Wave Momentum 2 does not have a classic shoe tongue again, but instead uh, your foot slips uh, into them like into the sock. Also inside the Wave Momentum 2 you will find a comfortable environment uh, for your foot. The excellent comfort is one of the main things I've been positive about the Wave Momentum for a long time. Even after several hours on my feet I didn't feel that uh, my legs and feet were tired uh, or that uh, the shoe was pushing me anywhere. Another positive is the weight of the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2. I didn't feel like uh, the shoe was uh, restricting me with its weight when I moved. Also due to the fact that it wraps the foot very well. Like any shoe, the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2 has its disadvantages, although in my opinion these are not major flaws of the shoe. In my case, the predominant color on this Wave Momentum 2 is white, so I expect the shoe to get dirty over time. Also, the breathability of the shoe could be a bit better. Sure, we mostly play volleyball in indoor gyms and halls where it's around 20 degrees, but if you have uh, several games in a row where your feet get sweaty, count on having to let your shoes dry out uh, for a longer period of time. Also, the price may be a disadvantage for some of you. The Mizuno Wave Momentum 2 is the top model of a volleyball shoe from Mizuno. This also corresponds to the price, which for the new model, like top models of other brands, will be around $150. In conclusion, I think you won't go wrong if you pick the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2. This is an advanced volleyball shoe with a new technology for impact cushioning. You get a shoe that comes in a new modern color variations, and after a few training sessions, I'm happy with the Mizuno Wave Momentum 2. It met my expectations, and I will continue to use it. Again, this is a suitable volleyball shoe that uh, I would recommend to all volleyball players who want to play good volleyball in quality volleyball shoes. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.